What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Sneez back with another video. Man, I'm out my hair, bro. That shit fucked up. But your boy getting the cut next week, man, for my trip. So stay tuned for that. Um, I'm back with another morning slash afternoon yap session. Um, you know what I'm saying? Y'all know how I get. You know how I get down the intros. Like, comment, subscribe. Do all that YouTube stuff. You know what I'm saying? Hey man, y'all keep going crazy in the comment section. I, I, you know what I'm saying. I like the um, I like to chat it up with y'all. You know, you know what I'm saying. Go back and forth in the comment section. Y'all, y'all keep going crazy in the comment section. Also, I wanna um, send praise out to people that's uh, in Florida that's about to uh be affected by Hurricane Milton. So my prayers go out to all y'all. Hopefully, some of y'all evacuated. Well, I seen a lot of y'all evacuating coming to uh, Georgia or. Going to like Jacksonville, so I hope y'all okay. Hope y'all got enough food, batteries, or uh, generators and stuff like that. Um, yeah. So today's job session is about everything ain't for everybody. You know what I'm saying? Um, the reason why I want to talk about this on my morning yacht session is I'm tired of y'all saying like. So I seen someone say anybody can do DoorDash. Anybody can do deliveries or shit like that. So, I'm going to tell you why a lot of people can't do everything, right? You know what I'm saying? So, my thing is, I was talking about, I had a conversation with somebody this morning about this. We were just going back and forth. I know I was telling, like, I was telling you what y'all was saying. Some of y'all saying, like, y'all just saying basically anybody can do their job, right? So, then I was like, I, in my head, I don't think everybody can do every job. Like, everybody can't be a trash man. Everybody can't be a postman. Everybody can't do UPS. And I'm going to tell you why. UPS, it requires you to pick up heavy packages. Everybody can't pick up heavy packages. Um, you delivering like 100 packages. You, you you going to like 200 stops a day. So every, some people don't have the mental capacity to do stuff like that. You know what I'm saying? That's a lot of driving. That's a lot of getting out of the car, going up flights and stairs. Just like everybody can't do Instacart. Instacart, you might get it. What does it say you get $100? What does it say? You get a hundred dollar order, right? You finna get paid hundred dollars, but you go on shopping for like eighty items. You know how many items it is? Like I don't know a lot y'all. I, I know a lot y'all don't shop, but uh, eighty items is a lot of items. We we'll just say they get ten cases of water, and you gotta go. Let's we'll say you gotta get ten cases of water, five packs of fucking ribs, um, some steak, some chicken. You get some milk. You get some bread. You get cartons of eggs. You get some condiments. You get vegetables. Just imagine you got to carry all that shit up five flights of stairs in the apartment. What is it? You got to go to the fifth floor, right? Now, mind y'all, some people are like, oh, they got an elevator. Every apartment doesn't have an elevator. Some um, some elevators may, some apartments made different. Like some, some in where my area, this is one apartment where you don't have elevator. It's straight stairs. It's like five flights of stairs on the fifth floor. Just imagine you got 10 cases of water, right? Who the fuck want to take 10 cases of water up five flights of stairs? It's just you too. Nobody there to help you just fly. It's just, you going up. Just imagine, bro. 10 cases of water. That means you got to come down. You're not, and these, these ain't no little ass cases. These are like 32, 32 uh, bottles of water in one case, right? I don't want to hear you going to take two cases up every time. You're not doing that shit. You're going to fuck your back up. So just imagine you got to come, you got to go up. Down, up, down, ten times, bro. For ten, and then you didn't get to the grocery part. I just told you, you got more shit. You got milk. You got bread. You got eggs. And I'm talking about they get more. Like every item, they get like three things in one item, right? So what they just got four cases of milk, right? And what they got five cases of eggs. I mean, the eggs ain't heavy, but it just imagine all the groceries you got to carry and all the vegetables you got to carry. Like that's a lot of shit you got to carry, bro. So what I'm saying is, every like that job ain't for everybody. Like nobody want. A lot of people don't even want to do that job, right? A lot of people don't want to do McDonald's. A lot of people don't want to be in a fast food restaurant. A lot of people don't want to be... A, a lot of people can't be a teacher and won't be a teacher, right? Because teacher, you know what I'm saying, you got to have a degree for it. A lot of people ain't going to college, so... And that's another thing. A lot of people... College ain't for everybody, too. Like, I'm not saying everybody can't go to college, like... But some people, you got to have money to go to college. Or some people just not... And not smart enough. And I don't think it's a smart enough thing. I think college is just, it's just like, 
I mean, all you gotta you all you gotta be able to do the work or whatever, right? But it's so more. A lot of people don't go to college because they can't afford, like I said, and a lot of people don't don't even want to go in debt. And then I see some people like, oh, you can do this job or you should go get this job, bro. Everybody's not qualified to do every job, bro. I'm I'm sorry to say that, bro. Everybody's not qualified to do every job. You have to find something that's good for you that you can do that you can do with no hesitation, right? So. Or just say you want to be a trash man, right? That shit, you know what I'm saying? A trash man, all they doing is picking up the trash, putting shit on the machine, and the machine dumping the shit, and they getting back off, and they riding them back of the truck. They go to the next stop, pick trash shit up. But my thing is, it shit sound easy, right? But you riding on the back of the truck, you getting hit by bugs, you got to smell shit all day, trash all day. Nobody want to do all that shit, man. So... Somebody got to do it, but everybody can't do it and won't do it, right? Same thing with McDonald's, right? You know what I'm saying? You taking orders. A lot of people can't handle a lot of stress. Like, what'd you say? What'd you say a morning rush come in, right? I'm talking about 30 niggas in line, right? Everybody can handle this shit. Like, uh, some people can't, like, comprehend shit faster. Or some people can't count money fast. Or some people get goddamn social anxiety. Or what they say you in the back of the kitchen, right? You know what I'm saying? Obviously, it's a machine and a timer on there. But you still can fuck shit up. Like, you put too much food inside the shit, it, it can goddamn, the grease can overflow. Or it goddamn, you know what I'm saying? Like, the shit sound, everything sounds simple, right? Just like cleaning a bathroom. Everybody can't clean no fucking bathroom, bro. Like, everybody can't clean up. But just be real, bro. Some people clean up better than other people. You know what I'm saying? Like, some people, just like, that's what anything in life. Some people drive better than other people. Somebody, some people cook better than other people. Somebody clean up better than other people. Somebody um deliver better like it's a real thing. People do better people do things better than any other people. You know what I'm saying? That's a real life thing. So I get tired when y'all be on y'all get y'all be on my comments talking about something, oh door that's easy as fuck. It's shit not easy because I'm gonna tell you one thing it's not easy about, right? So what if somebody send you a wrong address, right? Nine times out of ten, somebody if somebody send you a wrong address. Somebody gonna be like, you know what? I'm not taking that order. I'm gonna call support and I'm gonna be like, I'm gonna sign that shit. But some people might do it shit because you know what I'm saying, they're a good person. You know what I'm saying? Me personally, it just depends how I'm feeling. I might do it, I might not. Um like I said, shopping for Instacart, you gotta be special. Like you gotta be good at that shit because some people can shop in ten minutes. Some people it's a, sometimes it's a people oh whole hour shop for 20 items, you know what I'm saying? Like, everything you got to be good at, bro. Like, like another thing, like, delivering food. I'm not trying to chew my own horn, but, shit, my delivery time, that shit ain't one. Like, I'm always on time. Like, on DoorDash, before I got deactivated, I had, like, a 99%. Like, like you can, it's, like, it's like this little app where I can see, like, my delivery time against everybody in my city, bro. I'm number one. Like, no bullshit. Not even even bragging my shit. I'm number one on DoorDash and and um Uber Eats. Like my earnings, it's like I'm like number ten in the city for like earnings. Like I was going crazy. I mean, yeah, I was awake early, but the hustle in me, you know what I'm saying? That shit make it easier for me. Like I'm I'm so goddamn wired to this shit. This shit make it easy. Like you know what I'm saying? I know people say this shit easy. All you doing delivering food, but it's about how you deliver food, how effectively you deliver food, how much money you making, all that shit. Goes into one thing, like, yeah, anybody can go get in their car and deliver food, but my money to your money gonna be different because you might go a different way by making money or you might move slower. Like, like some people take their time delivering food, right? Like, I be in a restaurant, right? So, I be in a restaurant, like, this shit happened with you one time. Me and the dudes in the same, we was in the, we was in Chipotle at the same time, right? I got my food. Got in the car, dropped my shit off. I came back. This motherfucker was just pulling the parking lot. So I'm already on my second order. He on his first order, right? Come back. I'm on my third order. He just got the second order. Come on now. Like I'm moving fast as fuck, bro. Like, like if it's like I'm be real with y'all. If somebody took me good, I'm zooming that shit fast. Cause if I tip you, if I took so basically somebody took me good, it's basically like priority. Like they want their food on time. So shit, I'm gonna got now. I'm gonna try to go as fast as I can to get their food there. It's shit gonna be hot. And cause like with the, that was me and I'll tip me good. I want my food to be hot type shit. So yeah, man. Y'all gotta stop saying everything anybody can do any job. Cause anybody can't do any job. Like 
That's just like saying anybody can be a president. Anybody can't be a president. You know what I'm saying? Although the president don't, like, make every call and shit, but it's still, like, you got to know what the fuck you doing to be a president. Just like you gotta know what you got, you gotta know what you're doing to be a teacher. You know what you're doing to be a police officer. I mean, of course you gonna go to training and shit, but like I said, you gotta have the mental, the emotional, and all that other shit built into you know what I'm saying. Do certain shit like that's just like everybody saying you can play football. Everybody can't play football. <laughs> like you gonna put a woman out there with perfect with grown men out there in professional sport? Come on now, they don't get that ran the fuck over. Or that's just like saying, okay, fuck it, we gonna throw the WNBA away. We gonna, we gonna throw the WNBA away and put them in there with them. Put a, they gonna put the, they gonna put the male and the females together and play basketball. It don't work like that, bro. Like, just imagine, goddamn, the strongest person in the WNBA going against the strongest person in the basket and in, in NBA. They getting shit on. Like, what do you say? You put Brittany Griner against fucking Giannis on uh, Giannis. Y'all you know, dunking on her all the time. He backing her down, dunking on her, sending her shit. Like, half the motherfuckers in, in W can't even dunk for real. I mean, and then when it comes to dribbling, shit, the nigga, the NBA, I mean, don't get me wrong. Some g- girls, it's some girls out there that can dribble better than men. I'm going to be real with you. You know what I'm saying? But when it comes to the professional sport, it's level to this shit, bro. You know, it's level to this shit. Like, I'm not gonna lie, Kyrie gonna fuck any girl up. Like, handle wise, he fucking them up. Like, he gonna have their ass goddamn breaking. He gonna break the fuck out of their ass. A girl gonna try to go up on LeBron, he gonna block her shit. Wimby blocking her shit. Goddamn. Shit, you can take John Wall. John Wall, old ass. Man, he not even old. But John Wall, right now, would still fuck some W. He, he gonna fuck the whole league up in W. Like, y'all gotta understand this level to this shit, bro. Football players, like, Tom Brady, like, okay, Tom Brady is 40, like, 45. He down there 50. This nigga still probably can go out there. If they protect him. If they put him in a good line, this motherfucker still can go out there and throw 80 yards to touchdown right now. But me, I can't do that shit because this shit, I don't have to get this, I don't have to get to do that shit, bro. So, y'all gotta understand, it's levels to anything you're doing. Like, like when it comes to jobs or anything, it's levels to this shit, man. So, stop saying... You can do this, you can do that. Everybody can do this. It's levels with anything you do in life. So that's my y'all session for the day, man. Y'all let me know how y'all feel about what I just said. So uh sneeze out.